to the play. <laughs> This is like the perfect way. This is like mommy likes them. Mommy, feel that. That's a ushy mushy marshmallow. <laughs> mommy likes them cooked throughout. I think these are going to be your favorites, mommy. I like it. No, 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 no. Yeah, this way. No, I'll go over. <laughs> What are you two doing? Are you hiding from me? <laughs> Brody, go get them. Where are they? Get them. Get them. Get them. <laughs> Where are we? <laughs> uh, Sabino Canyon. Sabino Canyon. We couldn't bring Brody today. Daddy, can you tell us why we couldn't bring Brody? We couldn't bring Brody today because apparently there's big horned sheep out here and they think that dogs are predators. So it screws up how they live and, and travel all through this area. Ready, G? <laughs> if I can get my bag on. <laughs> there we go. Welcome to Sabino Canyon. This is a significant canyon located in the Santa Catalina Mountains and the Coronado National Forest, north of Tucson, Arizona. So we're gonna be coming up to the uh, Sabino Creek. What I wanna know. Uh-oh. What? All right, let's go. We walked less than a mile and these two want to stop and eat already. Get a grip. Don't tell me now. Well, I'm just, you know, Oh, this did come down here. Whatever, you, you can't get back on though. Yeah, you oh, yeah. walk right through a bit. After seeing the sign for mountain lions, we knew that wildlife existed, which includes deer, javelina, skunks, tortoises, rattlesnakes, but who would think you would see a mountain lion? So maybe you should unload your pockets and we'll look, keep one or two real nice ones, and then we'll look for more. Look at these little ones. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. No bicycles, wilderness. <sighs> yes, we are definitely in the wilderness. Yeah, we are in the middle of the Where desert. Okay, 
Okay, I'm safe now. The boys gave up on hiking to the seven trails because it was four miles out and four miles back. But curiosity got the best of me and I had to make it to Bear Canyon number 29. Typically, you would see the Sabino Creek running through these mountains. Bear Canyon number 29. Smack in the middle. And that is unfortunately all the water that's left. I'd be standing in the middle of the waterfall if they had their yearly monsoon. The drought has been so significant this year in the canyon, only puddles remained. Usually there are seven waterfalls. The solitude was good for me hiking back alone until I received a text message from Jeff with a picture of a mountain lion. The boys were within 75 yards of this mountain lion. Welcome to Mount Lemmon, where the elevation starts at 2,389 feet and goes all the way up to 9,159 feet in elevation. At the bottom of Mount Lemmon, you will find cacti and other succulents. At the top, it's a white surprise. So tell them about the bathroom experience. Interesting. What's interesting about it? So it's basically a big hole. That goes down? You pee in it. It goes down it goes how far? down like 4,000 feet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does. So. Did you get a fear of heights while you were going to the bathroom? Wait. <laughs> what? There's a seat. No, we don't have any of those items. There's a no, bridge? that's saying to bring sun protection. Why? Because that's what you need to bring. Oh. Yeah. It's 9,000 feet to the top. Well, breathing a little heavy because our elevation just went up like 1,000 feet. What do you think? You can't really get a concept of how far up we are, Jaxie. Well, I guess based on that tree right there. Mount Lemon is also part of the Coronado Forest. The San Pedro River Valley runs through the forest and can be seen from a few points on Mount Lemon. Mount Lemon was named after botanist Sarah Plummer Lemon, who trekked to the top of the mountain with her husband, a local rancher, by horse and foot in 1881. And this is what they call a ski resort. <laughs> okay, love. Welcome to Windy Point, Mount Lemon, Arizona. Stop.
definitely been such an amazing state. I don't think I want to leave. <laughs> Eleven house brewed beers and one cider. We also carry a broad selection of popular New Mexico wines. Food selection consists of brick oven pizza, nachos, Subs and panitis, nachos, pretzels with beer cheese. Oh yeah, we're going. Here. Jackson made dessert for us tonight. He cut up strawberries. Here's Mayan. That looked delicious. That's where I put Granola with there. cream, strawberries, blueberries, and some chocolate syrup. Ooh, and a blackberry. Oh, you're putting chocolate syrup in first. Ooh. I mean, I love chocolate and butter. Going for some blueberries. Yeah, he likes strawberries. Mmm, I forgot something. Huh? One more topping. Ready. What do you call this dessert? Yes, yeah. good. Gianni and I were able to fit in a mother son bike ride. If you ever visit Tucson, Arizona, I highly encourage you to try the Tucson Loop. It's 131 miles around the entire city. What'd you think of the Tucson Loop? Pretty cool. Some serious bikers on this loop. not do that. I don't know how you do that. I can't. I get scared. We know you're watching, so if you like our videos, don't forget to subscribe.